I just figured out a way to save a lot of time on Canva um, by making social media graphics and um, slide presentations all at the same time. So if you're an educator, you get a free Canva account, which is awesome. Um, and what I did was I picked a template and I started with an Instagram, an Instagram post, which is your typical square by square. And then I had my outline for this blog series or articles that I had written that I am presenting at a webinar tonight. And I went through and basically made a slide for each touch point I wanted to use on the outline, um, like I would for any other presentation. And I made, these are very basic, simple, generic things, but I made, um, a folder for this presentation, which is on guidelines for education during COVID. Um, so I started with the Instagram posts and then I just, so I can show you, um, this is what they look like. Very generic and basic, which is okay because I just needed to do it quick. But if you go to resize, you can click on any other thing. So then for the presentation, um, I already did this, but you copy and resize it. So now I have the presentation slides, which are exactly like the Instagram slides, but the right size for a PowerPoint. And I can download these as a PDF. And now my presentation is ready to go. So I was able to do this and make well, a lot of slides. There's 38 slides for this entire presentation. Um, but I was able to make um, my presentation slides, YouTube thumbnail images. Um, what were some of the other things? Instagram story. I have um, ones to share on Twitter, um, ones to share on Pinterest. So I was able to replicate these slides over and over again very quickly. And I would say this whole process took me between one to two hours um, just making the slides and replicating them. And the, the replication is the easy part. Making the slides is the most time consuming. So, and I have a brand kit um, for my, for the different things that I do. So. I just use my trauma-informed pedagogy, which is what this falls under, and the colors, the main colors right there um, for, for this, and that's why they're all kind of cohesive with the color scheme. Um, next time, they'll probably be cuter and have some graphics and stuff like that in it, but this is my first time trying this idea out for a quick way to make um, social media graphics and presentation slides at the same time. And it was relatively quick. So I suggest you give it a try.